Have you ever come across an injured bird and then wondered what to do or who to call for help? This morning, News for Jacks reporter Eric Avignier and his wife found this crow in their yard. It had been attacked by a hawk, could no longer fly, was barely moving, was running out of time. Tonight, Eric explains why the process is different compared to handling an injured dog or cat and what you need to know should you face a similar situation. This is the crow that was badly injured after it was attacked by a bird of prey. After learning animal control does not pick up injured wild birds, we learned an organization called Bird Emergency Aid and Care Sanctuary, also known as Beaks, rehabilitates injured wild birds. So we were instructed to pick up the animal with gloves, wrap it in a towel, and place it into a box. Then we were instructed to drop the animal off at Hidden Hills Animal Hospital, which works with Beaks. <laughs> Lindsay Kipper is a vet tech at Exotic Bird Animal Hospital in Jacksonville. She says they receive calls every day from people who find injured birds. This baby pigeon was brought in Monday morning after it was injured during a dog attack. It's very common, especially when at this time of the year and early spring when all the babies start hatching out. Kipper says if you find an injured bird, there's things you can do to help it. You can pick it up with some gloves, you can wrap it in a blanket and take it inside and figure out what to do next. The best thing to do is find a secure location. You can put it in a box or in a kennel. Once the injured bird is secure, you'll want to make sure it gets enough water to stay hydrated, but you have to be careful not to asphyxiate the animal because the esophagus and trachea are close together. So if you wanted to get some Pedialyte or filtered water, you can take a little oral syringe and just very gently drop by drop, put a little bit on the tip of the beak and let them kind of swallow it and continue doing that. If the bird is in really bad shape but there's a sliver of hope it can be saved, you can take it to an animal hospital where it can receive immediate treatment. Eric Avignet, Channel 4, The Local Station.